Hey guys, so today I'm here to do a tag, and this is the My Perfect Book Tag created by Carrie for over at Carrie for Life. I will link her in the bottom bar below, so you can check her out. Um, she created this tag because she um, passed over 300 subscribers, so congratulations to that. And she tagged a whole lot of people, and I was tagged, so I'm going to be doing this, and let's get started. So the f this is just um, a whole bunch of different categories to end up creating your perfect book. So the first one is genre. What um, genre or type of genre is your perfect book? I would have to say it would be dystopian, sci-fi-ish, mixed with action and adventure, and then a little bit of romance, and then overall that would be the perfect book for me. The next one is characters. Is your main character a girl or boy, and what is he or she like? I mean, my main character would be a girl, and definitely be independent and strong and smart. She'd be able to think out of the box and know what she's doing, and kind of be a step ahead of everyone else. Uh, question two: Is there a sidekick? Yes, the sidekick would definitely be a best friend. I love the best friends as a sidekick. I think it's amazing. Um, another thing would be kind of cool, um, just to meet someone along the way who you aren't really good friends with but they are an amazing sidekick so but I definitely prefer the best friend uh, question three is your villain totally evil or in the gray if it's a series I definitely want my villain to start out totally evil you know and then as the series progresses you un um, veil layers of that villain and I would love to have at the end of the series the villain be on the same side as the Purse people they were after, and then them two working in as a uh, on the same common goal, so that they're trying to find a new enemy. I think that'd be awesome. Question three. Um, no. Next category plot is a drama or action driven. Definitely action driven, without a doubt. Need the action. Um, how important is character development to a plot? Character development. The character development is definitely important because you don't want to read a story where the character doesn't progress at all. It's just the same, 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 same. You want development. You want new things to be unveiled. You want the character to grow. So, yeah. Question three. Would there be any paranormal aspects thrown in? Definitely. I am a big fan of the paranormal aspects um, types of books. So, those are the majority of the books on my shelf. So, I would definitely want there to be paranormal in the book. Um, romance. What's your idea of romantic interest? Uh, probably, maybe best friends. Um meeting each other, best friends falling in love, I think that'd be cool. But I really do like the whole, you know, meeting, you're just like meeting this new person in your life. They, It's not love at first sight, but you meet this new person and then you develop love. So I think that's, I like that. But um, question two, love at first sight or slowly developed? Slowly developed, definitely slowly developed. Because love at first sight, it's just, I don't know. I think it's that I think love at first sight doesn't really work for me because I don't really believe in I don't believe in love at first sight so I think that's why the books about that it's just not for me um so yeah question uh, three do they end up together uh, at the end definitely how could you not have them end up together at the end just it's like it's just like cruel <laughs> not to do it so. Uh, question, the next one is ending. Happy, sad, or bittersweet ending. Happy or bittersweet. Do not want a sad ending. Try to stay away from them with a sad ending because I don't like it. Uh, cliffhanger or tardy and neat. Um, if it's a series, definitely cliffhangers, but at the end of the series, I want it to be tardy and neat. I need to know what happens and that everything's answered and cleaned up. So, there you go. Um, lastly, does the perfect book ex already exist? For me, I have a bunch of favorites that I like, but the absolute 100% perfect book does not exist for me yet. Um, hopefully, I can come across it because I want to. It'd be amazing, but it has not happened yet. And question two, if no, uh, if no what author would you want to write your perfect book? I would have to say the author to write my perfect book... <sighs> I don't know. Uh, this is hard. I think I have to say Veronica Roth. I really like her writing style and I love her books, the, the Divergent books. So I think I'd have to say Veronica Roth. And also mixed in with um, Beth Rebus who wrote Across the Universe because that was a phenomenal book. So Veronica Roth and Beth Rebus I think put together 
could come up with a really, really interesting story. And so I would love to read that, but I think them to try to trade the perfect book together would be amazing, so i pick them too. <laughs> and so that's it for this tag. Uh, in her video, she tagged a bunch of people in the bottom bar, so I will be tagging quite a few people, so check it down below. And if I don't tag you and you still want to do it, go ahead and do it. I would love to see it. And video response to your videos to uh, Carrie, and I will have her channel link below again. And that's it, and I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!